Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React Native. So today we are going to implement such kind of sliders in your React Native project. So how we are going to do this? Let's have a look on that. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share, comment on my video. So let's get started. So here you can see that this is the parallax one. We all are autoplay, so these are autoplaying all the sliders. So if you want such kind of sliders, so what package I am used, I'm going to tell you which package I'm using one. So let's go to the code level. So here we go with that one. So first of all, I'm using the React Native Reanimated slider. Okay, so here we have React Animated Crossal. Okay, so this this package you need to install. It. This package comes with the three package, two more packages you need to install. I will tell you which one. So let's go to the documentation of that part. Okay. So let's go to this GitHub repository. And here we have, we have this, this you can make multiple. Okay. So you need to install React Native cro Reanimated Crossal with React Native Gesture Handler and React Native Reanimated. These two modules needs to be installed. Okay. After installing this module, you need to, uh, you need to use this code. But here you can see that there is an array of keys. So it, it printed with the one, two, three, four with the index. But I am doing with the images, right? So I will tell you how you can add the images over to it. Okay. So have we go with this one. So this images can come with this one. You need to add view activity indicator with this small image. Here you need to bypass the images with the source URI. And this is the path of all the images that are you are using. So you are using this one. You can hear you can see that this autoplay, right? Here all the data that we are sending. These are the props that you can use, whether it's to be autoplay, animation or anything. You can use it over here. Scroll animation is there, right? And here we have used the mode parallax. So this is the parallax. Second one is the parallax effect that you can see that over here. Okay, the second one. This is the parallax effect, this one. Okay. This is basic slider. This is the parallax one. This is the one, the basic one. So if you want to add such kind of thing, you can use this uh, plugin. Okay. And... Uh, Moreover, there are many more things over here. You can see there is like circular. There is many more demos over here like star cards, this one, tier, this one. So all you need to add with the custom animation, you need to add that animation over here. Then you can call it and then this way the animation part works. Okay. <clears throat> so any doubt, any query in that, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.